Praise the Lord, praise the Lord, praise the Lord. This is the day the Lord has made. We'll rejoice and be glad in it. Welcome to Morning Glow. Welcome to another time in the presence of the Lord. It's going to be great. It's going to be an awesome day. Heavenly Father, we worship, we praise, we magnify, we celebrate, we honor your name. Awesome God, mighty God, glorious God, God of faithfulness without injustice. Bless us this morning by the outstretching of your hand. Prosper your people, touch your people, heal your people, deliver your people. Let your name be glorified. We thank you, we praise you, we honor you, we celebrate your goodness. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Heavenly Father. Thank you, thank you, thank you. In Jesus' name. Amen, 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 amen. Praise the Lord, praise the Lord, praise the Lord. Wherever you have joined from this morning, we celebrate our God, we magnify his name, we make great his name from the rising of the sun to the going down of it. Somebody is going to be blessed today. Somebody is going to experience the grace and the power of our God. Our, our lives will never be the same. Someone will be touched by the Lord. Someone will be given testimonies in the name of Jesus. Praise God. We'd like to welcome you from wherever you have joined this morning. We praise the Lord for you. We trust the Lord that you will be blessed. Your life will never be the same in the name of Jesus. Your life will be a testimony. Your life will be a testimony. Your life will be a testimony. In Jesus' name, wherever you've done from around the world, make sure you love and uh, share about Morning Glow with your friends right now, right now, right now, right now. Let them know we are taking the time to prophesy the word of God into our life, to declare victory, to declare testimony, because today by the hand of God, someone will know grace, someone will know power, someone will see God at work. In the name of Jesus, not only uh, Morning Glow, every other meeting of KRCC, but this morning, please get on the phone, invite somebody, tell them, we are standing in the place of prayer, standing in the place of the prophetic. We are believing God for our stretching of his hand. Let us welcome you from all over the world, wherever you have joined from this morning. Please let me know so I can share and pray for you. Clapton in Hackney, London, the Lord bless you this morning. Richly, Bristol in Fishpond, God bless you in Jesus' name. Wellingbra in the Midlands, the Lord, the Lord, the Lord bless you. Richly, 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 Jesus' name. Stanwell in Stains, blessings. Praise the Lord. Queenstown. South Africa, I really need to know where this is in South Africa. Queenstown, which town is it close to? Saubona, God bless you this morning. Catford, Southeast London, be blessed and highly favored. In the name of Jesus. Eden Vale, also in South Africa. Saubona, God bless you this morning. Buari in Abuja, Nigeria. God bless you richly. San Ramon, California. Be blessed and highly favored this morning. Dizanaditi Kuzunori Teliri Barano Talishana Barado Sedidari Endero Sayarada Talarado Sante Tonta Tari Talero Torada Kaba. God will honor your faith this morning and bless you beyond measure. Jesus' name. Cumbria in Coventry, the Lord bless you. Uh, all right, so Queenstown is in the Eastern Cape. God bless you richly, 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 richly. In the name of Jesus, Male Koto Shinde in the Ibabos area. Eton in France, blessings. Sutton in Surrey, blessings. Uh, Clayford in Ilford, the Lord bless you today. Praise the Lord. Nayede, the Gambia, the Lord favor you this morning. Hackney in London, blessings, blessings, blessings. Barking in East London, blessings. Portsmouth, UK. Be blessed. Los Angeles, California. 
Be blessed and highly favored this morning in the West End of America. Cayman Islands, hey, we celebrate you this morning. May you be really blessed in Jesus' name. Netherlands, blessings on you. Uh, Aman in Jordan, the Lord bless you richly this morning. Houston, Texas, be blessed and highly favored. Monrovia, Liberia, Slough in Berkshire. Favor on you, blessings on you. The hand of the Lord will touch you, set you free, heal you, deliver you. Custom House, East London, blessings, blessings, blessings. Houston, Texas, the Lord bless you richly today. Wanosh Kayen Derebo, Medway in Kent, blessings of the Lord on your life. Hey, da 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 Reko Shondo Yiba Kazalari, Hewitson Garden in Smedic. God bless you richly. Praise the Lord. Wellington, Florida. The Lord bless you richly, richly, richly. In Jesus' name, Make Kozo, Borno State, Nigeria. The Lord bless you. We pray for peace of God upon your life. It's a place troubled by uh, Islamic uh, extremists. Stow Market in Ipswich. God bless you this morning in the name of Jesus. Amstar in Greater Manchester. Amstar in Greater Manchester. The Lord bless you richly today. May you be highly favored. Pretoria, South Africa, Saubona, Kunjani. God bless you richly today. May you be favored. May you be lifted. May you be above only. Kambo, Zokaya, Li, Robasha, Taye, Tataro, Rozeka. May God stretch his hand and prove himself in your life in the name of Jesus. Today will be the beginning of great beginnings, great favors. In the name of Jesus, your life will never be the same. Nebo jan debo rabiara, libo zondeka. Somebody will have a testimony today. In the mighty name of Jesus, glory to God. Oh, glory to God. In the name of Jesus, there's victory in your house. There's testimony in your house. In the name of Jesus, there's testimony, there's glory, there's a turnaround, there's a turnaround in the mighty name of Jesus. The Duma in Tanzania, the Lord bless you this morning. A poor in Namibia, God bless you richly. Barking in East London, blessings on you. Gulu in Uganda, blessings. Nairobi, Kenya, blessings. Berkeley in, the, in California, blessings on you this morning. Glory to God Almighty. Mande, Jali, Bruno, Zali, Qatar. We speak blessing on everyone who's on the platform. Today is going to be a powerful day. Uh, in the name of Jesus, Cape Town, South Africa, Salbona. Voskoten in the Netherlands. May you be blessed. Geneva in Switzerland. The Lord bless you richly, 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 richly today. In the name of Jesus, may you know the victory of Jesus, the testimony of our God. May you see our God at work. In the name of Jesus, may you have reasons to magnify God, reasons to glorify God. In the name of Jesus, oh hallelujah. This day somebody is going to give testimony in the name of Jesus. Oh glory to God. We'd like to welcome everyone who's joining us this morning. We believe God that this morning is going to be a powerful morning. It's going to be a day when God stretches his hand and does awesome things in your life. Please, one more time, get to invite somebody uh, and tell them we are taking authority this morning. Praise the Lord. And somebody is getting uh, victory in the name of Jesus. Somebody is going to have a testimony in the name of Jesus. 
This morning we're taking authority on when God steps into your matter. Ah, when God steps into your matter and when God steps into a matter on your behalf, there is a turnaround, there is a change, there is a testimony. So wherever you've joined around the world today, this morning is a specific, unique, peculiar morning because God is going to step into matters, turn things around, show his power in your life, give you an uncommon, unusual, supernatural testimony. God is going to step into your matter. He's going to open doors. When God steps into your matter, he's going to make things happen that no man can fix. When God steps into your matter, he's going to just make unusual, supernatural. Praise God things to happen when god steps into your matter he will wipe your tears you'll fill your mouth in, in in with testimony alvin slaughter that uh gospel artist wrote a song that's when he steps in when we have a work to do and the task ahead is bigger than you that's when he steps in when you know in your heart that god's command takes more than can be done by man that's when he steps in he sees you at the point of your need. He sees you at the point of crossing your Red Sea. In the moment you call, when, you, when you've given your all, he steps in. He steps in. What's that you have in your hand? I can use it if you are willing to lose it. Take the little you have and make it grand. I am El Shaddai and I'll more than supply your need. Praise God. Oh, wow. The song goes on, it says, a little boy's lunch of fish and bread is all you have for the need ahead. That's when he steps in. When all you have is oil in a jar, that's a reflection of where you are. That's when he steps in. Somebody this morning, you don't have much. God is going to step in. That's when he steps in. Somebody's going to have a testimony this morning because the Lord is going to step in. The Lord is going to prove himself. He sees you at the point of crossing your Red Sea. And there's no bridge. How what bridge will you build over a sea? There is no land. And then suddenly he makes a way where there seems to be no way. That's when he steps in. God always steps in at the point of need. And sometimes at the point of need when others have turned their back. God never let the children of Israel alone when he brought them out of Egypt. And when they came before the Red Sea, he stepped in. The sea was a great obstacle that blocked them and gave their enemies an opportunity to pursue and attack them. But he stepped in. The sea can be a big challenge and looks like you will be swallowed. Somebody this morning, I don't care the size of the sea. I can testify to you after all these 52 years of knowing Jesus as my Lord and Savior. I can testify to you. He steps in. He steps in. He steps in. Oh, you got you to gotta join us tonight during the, tonight's uh, night of testimonies. One of the testimonies is 25 years baby after 25 years of waiting for a child. He stepped in. Oh, these are Jesus. He stepped in. You gotta share. Join us tonight. Praise the Lord. He sees obstacles. He steps in. Exodus 14, verse 15 and 16. Then the Lord told Moses, Why are you crying out to me? Tell these Israelis to move out. You are to raise your staff. Stretch out your hand over the sea. Divide it. So the Israelis may go into the middle of the sea on dry land. Maya to Shenake. So this morning, somebody hearing me wherever you are. Get ready for the step in God. Get ready for the step in God. Get ready for the step in God. What shall we say of a woman, a widow? She has nobody. Her husband is dead. He left the mountain of indebtedness. I'm sure she had wishes. One of the wishes would have been to just go back to him and say, why did you leave us so messed up, totally in, it, in trouble, and left with sons, no money, no food, nothing in the house. The woman runs to the man of God, 2 Kings chapter 4, from verse 2 to 7. Her husband is a righteous man, a holy man, but 
it was wholly broke. Uh, it wasn't the Lord that disappointed, but you see, sometimes we just don't know how to tap into God's super supernatural provision. Debt free, so was what she needed. She ran to Elisha. Nowhere to go when you don't know what to do. Nowhere to go when you don't know what to do. Nowhere to go when you don't know what to do. Some people will run to those who will rearrange their indebtedness. It is still indebtedness. The woman, Taya, Kababarosha, she went where the anointing can destroy the yoke. Ah, glory to God, where the story can change. Man of God, as that what you have in your house, because God cannot work with nothing. Zero multiplied to the power of 10 is still zero. But this woman said, I have a jar of oil. That was enough. And this was more the moment that from nothing to something, God, the woman was to go borrow vessels. You also need to expand your horizons. Get out of your tiny vessels, your tiny vision, tiny scope, tiny level, tiny dream. Do something that will make people hear about you and think you are mad, you are crazy. Dream dreams. Dream dreams that even when you are gone, your sons, your daughters can plug into it and the dream will continue. Our God is a God of miracles. You need to give him the chance to step in, to turn things around, to make things happen. Wherever you are this morning and you have joined us, the step in God will step in for you. The step in God will step in for you. The step in God will step in for you. The step in God will step in for you. He'll give you a testimony. Ah, da 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 little thing handed over to him he can turn to a, tes to a testimony this woman god stepped into a situation and that jar of oil filled the pots paid the debt not only did he pay the debt there was a remnant there was a remnant there was a remnant far and in excess of all that we ask or think or hope or pray or dream of he can do ephesians 3:20. He can do in excess of the things we ask or think or hope or dream or pray for. According to the power that works in us. All you need to do is let him step in. Glory to God. That stepping God is stepping in for someone this morning. Testimony is coming in to your house, to your life in the name of Jesus. What shall we say about the stepping God? He is the God who turns things around and no man can stop him. When God steps in on your behalf, everybody will see it. People will know this thing has happened. God has done it. In the name of Jesus, get ready for the step in God. Get ready for God to wipe your tears, fill your mouth with laughter, give your life celebration, a reason to magnify him, a reason to celebrate him. When men of this earth step in for us, we feel peace, we feel happy, we feel, oh, something has happened, now I have joy. Imagine when God himself, God himself steps in for you, there is a change, favor comes, a divine direction comes, testimony comes, the soup natural hand of God that exceeds, excels above everything is seen when God steps in for you. This morning, get ready. As we prophesy, when God steps in, he will step in for you in the name of Jesus. Our God is a God who can step in, as we saw from those scripture, because with him nothing shall be impossible. Luke 18, 27. And he said, the things which are impossible with men are possible with God. Naled Osha, to step in is to intervene. May God intervene for you in the name of Jesus. Intervene, intervene for you in the mighty name of Jesus. To step in is to get involved. God will get involved in your matter. Pranosa, when people we don't want get into our matter we say why are you getting involved in my matter but we want god to get involved may god step in may god step into your matter turn things around when god steps in i just saw a vision oh my god i just saw this revelation i love this one i'm seeing oh my <laughs> I, I saw two feet one is the is the 
is the feet of a baby really this size and the other one i didn't see its end and the tiny one is your feet and the other one is the feet of god in fact see this feet of this newborn baby is really so tiny and i see these huge feet ah the big foot himself this is not some funny thing found in the bushes of america big foot the big foot himself Jehovah El Shaddai will step in, step in, step in, step in, step in, step in. Hey, Kaka, Riku Tosha. I also see a revelation. It is very strange. Somebody is driving. It's like through some with bushes in the place, and suddenly the road they are driving on. There's a huge tree. Huge tree blocking them, and saying you can't go past here. You may have to come down suddenly. Somebody shows up from somewhere. I can see him. There's this huge axe in his hand. And he's chopping off that tree to its bottom and removing it out of the way. There is a way out. There is a way out. There is a way. When God steps in, hindrances are removed. When God steps in, limitations are removed. When God steps in, where there was no way, there is a way. Receive this morning. Receive this morning. Receive this morning. Receive this morning. When God steps in, he, there is a taking action. Ah, God will take action on your behalf. To step in means to, to mediate. To mediate, Alabota, Rika, Rota, Zeba, Pranosha, between you and that matter, God comes in. Between you and that matter, God comes in. Mediate, middle, mediate. God comes into it. God comes into it. Receive in the name of Jesus. I prophesy on somebody this morning to to come to step into matter. Matter is to arbitrate to come and say, okay, this is my judgment. Ah, God will judge you victorious. He will judge you testifying. He will judge you with grace, with power, with grace, with power, with grace, with power. Alaneto, idaba into, ileri manta, kabari kabi kabi dadi kabari tolari waroguske di alaraba. Let God arise. Let God arise. God will step in because He will never forget you or forsake you. This morning, wherever you are, widow or married, single or married, young or old, men and women, child and parent and adult, get ready. God will never forsake you. He will never forget you. He will never forsake you. He will never forget you. Isaiah 49, 14 to 16. But Zion said, the Lord has forsaken me and the Lord has forgotten me. Can a woman forget her second child that she should not have compassion on the son of her womb yea they may forget yet will i not forget thee behold i have tattooed you upon the palms of my hand that walls are continually before me this morning i declare to your life because you matter god will step into it say how do i matter the blood of redemption change your story you may have been born in the worst of the villages in some tiny place with a name difficult to pronounce. Alanedi Tonkabalia, Genebra, Rika, Teko, Hebra. Oh, I'm seeing a revelation and it's a bit of a funny one. I saw a person as if they, they were to eat, they've not eaten in a long time. So they brought this huge plate, full of food, looks like rice. I'm not a rice eater, so it's not my imagination. But the person showed with a small spoon, and I saw that they were contemplating doing what we, were, we did when we were kids. When we were kids, we were poor. And sometimes they put the food in the, in the tray. They put all the rice in the tray. And about three, four of us would sit. The one with the biggest hand grabbed the biggest rice and uh, kind of uh, squeezed it to become a lump. I saw this person said, I must not miss all this food. 
they put aside this one. I declare and decree this morning. Somebody needs unusual provision. And your purse is small. That is the vision of that spoon. Your source is small. Your purse is small. But God will give you capacity. God will give you breakthrough this morning. Financial supply, supernatural supply, uncommon supply. In Jesus' name. Hey, I see that feet again. That tiny baby feet and the huge big foot. That, ti that tiny feet is so tiny. It's like a baby just born. And this huge big foot. Ah, God steps in. God steps in. God steps in. In your matter, God steps in in the name of Jesus. God will never forsake you, forget you. Somebody is facing some challenges. You don't know what to do. Receive divine solution. 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 Receive divine solution from this morning. In fact, somebody on the altar also, God wants me to tell you, cry no more. Cry no more. He has stepped in. Cry no more. He has stepped in. Cry no more. He will step in and give you victory. He will step in and give you victory. When God steps in, everybody will know this thing is not because this woman is a good person. This thing is not because this man had lived a righteous life. It is just God stepping in. In Jesus' name. Somebody is facing a stormy situation. God is going to step in this morning. Stormy situation. God will step in. Mark chapter 4, verse 35 to 40. And the same day when the evening was come, he said unto, he said unto them, Let us pass over to the other side. And when they had sent away the multitude, they took him even as he was in the ship, and there were also with him other little ships. And there arose a great storm of wind, and the waves beat into the ship, so that it was now full. And he was in the hinder part of the ship, asleep on a pillow. And they awake him, and say unto him, Master, carest thou not that we perish? And he arose, rebuked the wind, and said unto the sea, Peace! Be still, and the wind ceased, and there was a great calm. And he said unto them, Why are you so fearful? How is it that you have no faith? This morning, everyone facing any kind of storm, marital storm, financial storm, job storm, employment storm, career storm, family storm, uh, health storm. Hey, some people, the key situation is health storm. They are dealing with one major health issue. Then they said they've discovered another one. Hearing this word, I'm not sure. My medicine is messed up. Uh, but I'm hearing fungi problem. Do humans have fungi problem? Uh, I hope my people will be able to respond to me. A fungi problem. I, I thought that fungi is something you see that grows either on food or trees or something. Do people have fungi problem? Somebody has a health storm <laughs> this morning. We take authority. We command total health. Oh, yes, on feet and toes. Oh, my jeez. All right. <laughs> I just saw that word. I heard that word, fungi. Okay, we release healing, we release health, we release healing, we release health, we release healing, we release health, we release healing. Everyone facing any form of storm, particularly health storm, receive your healing. Come out of that bed of languishing, totally healed, totally healthy. In the name of Jesus, every storm that says it will swallow you. Aka, Ompa, Rita, Pate, Dobra, Tesha, Kepro, Tozi, Rika, Pradi, Toroba, Terira, Kababa, Terido. Aya! We command total victory. 
when it seems like the storm is raging fiercely and control and uncontrollably receive divine intervention god will step in god will step in god will step in god will step in when it seems as if the enemy is gaining up and the devil is a liar you say is a man who has lies and caricatures that make him look like a lion he only roars like he is not the lion there can only be one lion in the realm of the spirit the lion of judah we silence every voice of the enemy god gains the upper hand in your life. God gains the upper hand. Not your issue. God gains the upper hand. Not the battle. God gains the upper hand. Not the trouble. God gains the upper hand. God will step in. 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 God will. In the name of Jesus. This morning I declare and decree. Live our all. And Jesus said. Peace. And the Bible says. And there was great calm. The Greek there is mega irony, mega irony, and there was mega irony, mega peace. For great storm, there was great peace. I speak into your life this morning. Ah, when God steps in great peace, great breakthrough, great favor, great testimony, great peace, great breakthrough, great testimony, great peace, great breakthrough. Ay, kato shatala. Before the end of today, somebody must have a unique testimony, a unique peculiar testimony, a unique and peculiar testimony. Hiraba, hirada, hirede, hirabo, hiraba, hirado, tayada. Jesus woke up out of sleep from that from that boat, and because he had the key to the storm they face. The master controller controlled the atmosphere. The disciples couldn't handle it. They said, what kind of man is this? Even the storm obeys him. I speak into your life today. Mega peace. Mega peace. God will step in. God will step in every threat. Wherever it's coming. Financial threat. Threat from government. Threat from, 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 from tax. Threat, threat, what? Ever kind of threat, but that he, that that he, God, the God, the God who owns the whole earth, the God who owns the cattle upon a thousand hills. It's a strange one. It's a strange revelation. I'm trying to make sense of it. I see a vision of a person who is trying to put their hand in their pocket. But even the pocket has been threaded so that it's been sewn back, so there's no pocket. Ah! No, 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 no. This level of fighting against your finance is from the pit of hell. Where I see it seems as if somebody or somewhere had come to, to thread and sew off the hole of your pocket so that you can't put hand in the pocket and they've sewn it up. Jesus, Jesus. He da ba la da ba, he shata la da ba, he kere da ba da, he kata ya da ba, he kala da ba do. I go into the realm of the spirit this morning, and I prophesy into your economic realm, into your economic experience, into your finances. I declare change. 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 I declare turn around. I declare change. I declare turn around. I declare change. Naridi hariba. Tarika Kabara Tarida Habara Tarika Kabari Tarika Kabara Tarika Kabara Tarika Kabara Tarida Arabosha Somebody whom the enemies fight in you on the financial realm. One of the worst battles, one of the worst Goliaths is the Goliath of finance. Defying the prayer of Christians, boasting that you can't bring him down. Ah! Today, I pull down Goliath. Pull down the Goliath of financial battle. I pull down Goliath of financial battle. I speak, God steps in. God steps in. God steps in. Let God arise. Let his enemies be scattered. God steps in. God steps in. Into your financial matter. God steps in. From this morning, God steps in. In the mighty name of Jesus, that storm that 
has boasted to take you down, you rise above it. You rise above it. You rise above it. Have you noticed the Bible says when that storm came, Jesus was in the bigger boat and smaller boats were following. The smaller boats are looking to the bigger boat. Whatever happens to these big boats, if this storm can swallow these big boats, no chance for us. Ah, you will be a testimony. You will be a testimony. Your breakthrough will cause other people's breakthrough. Your favor will cause other people's favor. Your turnaround will cause other people's turnaround. Your change will cause other people's change. Your breakthrough will cause other people's breakthrough. Receive, 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 receive. In the name of Jesus. I speak into somebody's life this morning. In Jesus' name. Second Kings chapter 3 verse 17. For thus saith the Lord, you shall not see wind, neither shall you see rain. Yet that valley shall be filled with water that you may drink, both you and your son, your cattle and your beasts. Wow. No rain, no wind. Yet these men who have not had water for almost seven days were told tomorrow there will be water. Ezekiel 21 verse 27. Ezekiel 21 verse 27. I will overturn, overturn, overturn it. And it shall be no more. Until he whose right it is, I will give it to him. God said he will overturn it three times. Every time I took tiki tika de kabari no to yaba. Ishkane de bala no koro kabari gede ishkale da maratoria. Ere da bro toli yama rando skije nde lira ba taleria. Every time the enemy comes, God will overturn it. Isaiah 43 verse 2, when thou passest through the waters, I will be with you. And through the rivers, they shall not overflow thee. When you walk through the fire, they shall not burn you. Neither shall the flame kindle upon you. This morning, wherever you are, let your amen be very powerful. The person who has been wiping away tears of sorrow, I prophesy, God will step in. 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 For things to begin to move according to the plan of God for your life. God will step in. 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 For heaven and earth to be moved in your favor. God will step in. 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 God will step in in the name of Jesus. For you who is a candidate of unmerited blessing, unmerited favor to walk in that blessing, God will step in. God will step in. I just saw a revelation. I see somebody came with a blank paper and a pen. They said, write your dreams. I will make it happen. Oh, Jesus. We're going to prophesy on that one, man. Every dream, every aspiration we carry in our spirit for this year, for this quarter, for this year, for this quarter, for this year, for the rest of our life. We believe, we receive, we believe, we receive. God will step in. God will step in. They brought a pen and a sheet of paper and said, write, write your dreams. Get ready to have a testimony. The Lord himself will do it. And there will be testimony in your life. Hallelujah. Oh, glory to God. Glory to God. I don't know if this is past or present, but there's a person who once had a Muslim name like Wasilat. Wasilat. God said, it's your season of favor. 
Get ready because there is going to be favor coming upon your life in a way that you have never seen, never, never handled. There is also a roof on the platform. God is going to show you favor in this season. He's going to wipe your tears and give you uncommon testimony. Ah, glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. Ah, I speak into your life this morning. Somebody who thinks look dead. Ah, God will step in. He looks dead, but life will come. God will step in. God will step in. God will step in. Everybody have pronounced the situation as dead, but God will step in. 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 In the name of Jesus, darkness will fade, light will shine when God steps in. So this morning, every darkness must fade, light must shine. Darkness must fade, light must shine. God steps in. God steps in. Thank you, Jesus. Oh glory. Oh glory. Oh glory. Narida baba baba. Hirida da dirida. Hirida da da bada. Hirida da dirida. Hirida da doroshka. Hirida da 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 da. All disturbances must step out. God will step in. God will step in. All disturbances, financial disturbances, emotional, spiritual disturbances on your family, on your joy. Ah, God steps in. 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 In the name of Jesus, impossibilities become impossible. God steps in. When God steps in, what they said is impossible. God makes possible. Aleba, hirida, 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 hirida. Removal of shame, dishonor, reproach happens when God steps in. When God steps in, shame, dishonor, reproach is removed. Receive, 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 receive favor, receive testimony, receive glory, receive breakthrough, receive favor, receive testimony, receive breakthrough in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. And the Losh Kayedeba, Hilibrodo, Hidededa, Hirada Toro, Hida Bosch Kayandara. When God steps in, failure steps out and success steps in. This morning, may success step into your life. Success come into your life. In the name of Jesus, every trace of failure, we pull you out of it. We pull you out of failure. We pull you into blessing. We pull you out of failure. We pull you into blessing. We pull you out of failure. We pull you into testimony. When God steps in, he restructures your life. He rearranges your destiny. First Chronicles chapter 4 verse 9 and 10 and uh, the Bible says and the man uh, was born and his mother called him Jabez because he was born in a season of sorrow and Jabez called on the name of the Lord and said oh that you will prosper me expand uh, enlarge my coast do not let harm come upon me increase my territory and God answered him his destiny rearranged his story rearranged because God steps in a part of and the earth this morning, somebody hearing me in the four corners of the earth, wherever you are this morning, hearing the sound of my voice, I speak into your life. Things that have held you, held you down, held you down. I see this funny revelation, like a man was made to sit down and this thing has two claws, iron claws, and one was put on the left shoulder and one on the right shoulder. All right. <laughs> Every burden on your shoulder will be destroyed from this morning. Every burden on your shoulder holding you down. Sky, don't get up. Don't get up. We break that thing in the name of Jesus. Today, you rise, you move, 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 you rise, you move. You break into new levels of destiny. When God steps in, Rearranges destiny. When God steps in, wounds and scars are removed. Ah, glory, <laughs> glory will replace your wound. 
testimony will replace your wound. Favor will replace your wound. Where you had bowed your head in shame, you will lift your head in praise. Where you bowed your head in shame, you will lift your head in praise. Where you bowed your head in shame, you will lift your head in praise. Where you bowed your head in shame, you will lift your head in praise. Where you bowed your head in shame, you will lift your head in praise. Where you bowed your head in shame, you will lift your head in praise. Where you bowed your head in shame, when God steps in. He brings a full restoration when he steps in. Full restoration. When God steps in everything you have lost. The Bible says, Job chapter, Job chapter 42 verse 10. And God restored the fortune of Job. Restored his fortune and God. And God, and you know, plus God, and God, before it was, and Satan, and Satan made all those things to be destroyed. And God restored the fortune of Job. Ah, this morning, and God, and God, plus God. The stepping in God is stepping in for you. The stepping in God is stepping in for you. The stepping in God is stepping in for you. When God steps in, it takes, it, it, it takes the embargoes that have been placed on your life. That's it. Remove the embargo. Do you know there are people, embargoes have been placed on their life. Finance is not flowing. Nothing is flowing. There is an embargo on their life. You have never seen Amber go before? Ah, remember going to Zimbabwe when there was not a serious Amber go on grounds? The stores were full. The, the supermarkets, that everywhere was filled. In fact, my honest experience, first time I went to Zimbabwe, I was saying, did this plane make a mistake and show up in Europe? Everything was in order. Man, man, suddenly the embargo emptied the stores power failure you see, you look at the supermarket i remember driving one time from 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 bulawayo to for harare five hours drive man and you look at as you drive through a town you look into a store and it's dark and it's a mall a dark mall because of embargo today every place where light was and darkness had taken over in your life we come out, we command a powerful change. Embargo is broken. Siege is removed. The embargo is broken. The embargo is broken. The embargo is broken. Cairo Shakaiba in Jesus' name. What is a siege? A siege is when the enemy stays with you and refuses to move so that you're unable to do anything that is your dream. You can't pray well, your blessing is not moving, favor is not flowing, nothing is working. It happened in Israel, in the days of Hezekiah, that <laughs> they surrounded the country, the enemy surrounded Jerusalem. For three years, the people inside Jerusalem could not go out. They grow food, food inside town because there's a wall around. They grew the food inside town, found a river. They were under a siege. Nothing was working until the day God broke the siege. The king who caused this, his own sons killed him. I professor, the siege is over. When God steps in, financial siege comes to an end. Receive in the name of Jesus. When God steps in, health siege comes to an end. Receive total health, total health. When God steps in, Peace seed comes to an end. Receive absolute peace. Absolute peace. When God steps in, ah, the seed becomes over. Rabaka, Yuneka, Elita, Tarata, Tarota, Shata, Hebra, Akushika, Yadali Riba. God will fight for you. I prophesy unto your life. God steps in. God steps in. God steps in. From this morning, go and testify. Go and be ready to see the hand of God. He will step in. 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 In Jesus' name, when God steps in, He takes a man's shame. He turns it to fame. He takes a man's shame. He turns it to fame. Second Kings chapter seven. Leper.
who were men of shame, who had to walk the outskirts of town because of their diseases. They can't walk inside town. They have to even announce, unclean, unclean, unclean. The book of Levit Leviticus requires that they should announce themselves shamefully. Unclean, unclean, so people can run. Uh, so people can run ah, in terrible dark seasons of Africa, in towns in which I lived, there were these terrible sacrifices they will carry, which they believe if you saw it, it could have dire consequences on you. So when they are carrying it like three in the morning or four, they will be announcing, nobody looks at it. So you ran away because you must not see it. Once you saw it, you had a point of contact. Same thing with this man. Unclean, unclean. But God took their shame. He turned them to men of fame. God took their shame. He turned them to men of fame. God took their shame. He turned them to men of fame because he stepped in. I speak into somebody's life this morning. Wherever you are, Kabarosha, Hidibakaza, Rikozola, Rino, Kavish, Karosh, Hidaba, Terodo, Karaba, Ezandere, Librosha, Hirakosa, Hikatala, Remosha, Hikaba, Kabaro, Hishka, Kebra, Henda, Kebro, Tareka, Habrashka, Hikusa, Teyaba, Baba. Some people are waiting to see your nakedness. But God will turn your shame to fame, your shame to fame. They are waiting to mock you and laugh and say, look at this, it's not finished. Ah, Kobosha! Hida, every prophetic word that is negative that has been spoken into your life, I nullify it, I cancel. I nullify it, I cancel. Every expectation of somebody who says, oh, I had a dream, I saw her dead. I had a dream, I saw him dead. I had a dream, I saw him lose. I had a dream, I saw her lose this blessing. I saw him lose that blessing. I had a dream. I saw this evil happen to us. We cancel that evil for in the realm of the spirit this morning. Every negative, God steps in. God steps in. Let God arise. Let his enemies be scattered. Let God arise. Let his enemies be scattered. Let God arise. Let his enemies be scattered. Every negative, somebody waiting to see your shame. No, God steps in and covers you with fame. Instead of shame, he 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 covers you with fame. When God steps in, he makes you the miracle. You, you become a miracle. People will look at you, they will not be able to figure your life. Because everything you touch is a miracle. Everything you do is a miracle. Everywhere you go is a miracle. I'm prophesying on somebody this morning. The days of darkness is over. The darkness is over. The darkness is over. The darkness is over. The darkness is over. From today, your life is a testimony. Your life is a glad testimony. From today, your life is a testimony. From today, your life is a testimony. From today, Today, your life is a testimony. From today, your life is a testimony. From today, your life is a testimony. Abokosheta, your life is a miracle. You will be a walking miracle. A walking miracle. When God steps in, a man becomes a walking miracle. Ah, they said his name is Son of Sorrow. God turned his life to a walking miracle. He became the person whom they had to enter his own record, specially. You see, when they were writing names in the days of Jabez, they were just writing their name, and this regard that, and this regard that, and this regard that. When they got to him, they stopped. We can't just say, and this regard that. This man, God stepped into his life. His life became a miracle. Arush! Palakidia! Somebody on this platform this morning, your life will become a miracle. Your life will become a miracle. God is stepping in. God is. Yes, so a revelation. I don't know what. They've gathered together against you and they are intending to bring it against you. I go into the realm of the spirit. This roaring, this roaring, this roaring. I see this cobra is a terrible one. Uh, somebody's on the line, they are putting together some things with it to attack you. And I, I see this cobra. And I can't even understand the kind of cobra. Cobras, yeah, this size. Then when they widen their neck, it is this size. But this one is like 
So how can the, I mean, it means it's full of poison, but let God arise, let his enemies be scattered. Every demonic cobra, every serpentine spirit, every foul entity intending to destroy your life, every false information they put together, every intention to attack you, attack your family, attack your business, every intention to try to scandalize your life, I bring the blood, I cancel it. 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 This morning, God intervenes in your life. God steps in. He makes you a miracle. He makes your life a miracle. He makes your future a miracle. He makes your family a miracle. He makes your business a miracle. He makes everything about you a miracle. A miracle. A miracle. A miracle. A miracle. A miracle. Tati tati tareba. Horashkadia. Hebratosia. Herikabaro. Hebratoskidia. Heleroshka yadaba tolosada. When God steps in. He decorates your destiny when God steps in. He decorates your destiny. That's what he did to Ruth. Whoever met Ruth a couple of years later will not believe it's the same widow woman, Moabite, whom Deuteronomy 23 verse 2 and 3 says they should exclude her, leave her outside. But God smiled on her. When God steps in, He redecorates your destiny. This quarter, this year, a decoration of your destiny, a lifting. The siege is over. I'm supposed to say that to someone. The battle is over. Go and wash your face. Get ready to celebrate. Buy your dressing, your dress, your dress, or whatever you want to wear. Be ready for the celebration. Ah, the next Thanksgiving, let them see you tearing apart Prayer City with a different kind of dance. They may not even understand why you are dancing that much. But I'm supposed to tell you the siege is over. And God will step in, he'll give you a new song. God will step in, he'll give you a new song. God will step in, he'll give you a new song. God will step in, he'll give you a new song. God will step in, he'll give you a new song. Alibada Shonodikia Prani Talibra, Ishonaba Katili Kabaru to Zali Baran Tali Dara Baro Tali, Hikaito Rabo Sataya, Abro Shekayara, Riko Soliriba, Libra Torokasha, Hike Baro Dari, Hibra Dorozana, Nambre Dorozeli, Nabra Kodorari, Tabre Kurodari. God will step in. He'll give you a new song. God will step in. He'll give you a new song. God steps in. He turns lack in your life to provision and abundance. Provision and abundance. Provision and abundance. Provision and abundance. Everywhere you turn in your life, provision and abundance. Kalabarito, Ishaliriba, Herikarada, Rebosa, Renisha, Kaita, Lebrosha, Likababa. Every need you brought to the platform this morning shall turn around to become a testimony. Every pain that I have not mentioned today, I declare to your life, God steps in, God steps in, God steps in, God steps in. Favor comes upon you, God steps in, God steps in, God steps in. God steps in for job interviews this week and this month and this quarter. God steps in, God steps in, in the name of Jesus. For business contracts and contacts, God steps in. God steps in in the name of Jesus. For marrying into a new family, for marriage to happen for you, God steps in. For being accepted in that place you dream to enter, for your son, for your daughter, God steps in. For the vision you have for your family, God steps in. For the breakthrough you've been desiring, God steps in. For the things you've been crying to God to make happen, God steps in. God steps in. For the testimony you've never given before to become reality 
God steps in this morning. I close this segment before the last prophetic word. Listen to me wherever you are. I want your amen to be powerful. I declare and decree. Let your amen be powerful from this morning. Defeat bows out of your life in the name of Jesus. Lack bows out of your life in the name of Jesus. From this morning, sickness bows out of your life in the name of Jesus. From this morning, Sadness bows out of your life in the name of Jesus. From this morning, impossibilities step out of your life in the name of Jesus. From this morning, failures bow out of your life in the name of Jesus. Bad news is banished in the name of Jesus. Darkness vanishes in the name of Jesus difficulties step out of your life confusion of mind step out of your life this morning i declare and decree psalm 30 verse 11 thou hast turned for me my mourning into dancing thou hast put off my sackcloth and guarded me with gladness i speak into your life this morning god replaces your crying with dancing God has removed the cloth of shame, mourning, and grief and replaced it with the cloth of gladness and celebration. The sound of celebration will break out in your house. The sound of joy, the sound of favor, the sound of blessing will be in your house. There will be a new dance step in your life, a new celebra celebration. In the name of Jesus, Yebo Kosoba, in this stepping in season of God in your life, what cannot be fathomed will begin to happen. What cannot be explained will begin to happen in the name of Jesus. Marriage of the marriage of Cana in Galilee, water turning to wine. Ah, it will begin to happen in your life. It will begin to happen in your life. You begin to happen in your life. Woman with the issue of blood healed instantly. You begin to happen in your life. You begin to happen in your life. You begin to happen in your life. Mordecai from gate man to become the owner of estates. You begin to happen in your life. Let your amen be powerful. Man by the pool of Beth Esther. The yoke was broken that held him for 38 years wasting his life if his life is 70 like it is in moses's book then more than half of his life is gone god steps in for you from today inadequacy was banished when jesus turned water to wine god will do it for you at the tomb of lazarus dead dreams dead future came alive receive in the name of jesus Ayrosha. by the lake of Gennesaret, luke chapter 5 an empty boat became overloaded with blessing receive in the name of jesus the widow who wept because her last hope was gone her son had her son given back to her Untimely death will not visit your son, your daughters, your grandchildren, your great-grandchildren. It will not visit your house. The sound of sorrow will be over this year. It doesn't matter how long. God will remember you. Give you a testimony. In Jesus' name. Resending your testimony tonight is a testimony night. Powerful, powerful. Don't say I is small. We need your testimony to encourage somebody. Uh, be one of our biggest highlights today is give you a lowdown of one of the sisters and brother in our church. They've been with us almost 20 years, 25 years of marriage. Suddenly this week, 
of testimonies. God gave them a beautiful baby, handsome, awesome. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nali koto kasa ti 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 tata libro zati karaba. I love one of the names they gave the baby. You want to know the name? Join me this evening. Uh, two names, two of the names they gave the baby are amazing celebration. Join me this evening. It's going to be so powerful tonight. So powerful. So powerful. Tap into the power of testimony. Send your own testimony. Even it was last quarter or December, send it in. Send it by WhatsApp. We will read it. It will encourage somebody. In the name of Jesus, praise the Lord. So tonight is testimony night. It's going to be awesome, 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 awesome. In Jesus' name, in Jesus' name. Remember to challenge others to join us. I saw a good number of nations that joined us today. Hey, that's so beautiful. If you're joining us for the first time, please make sure you stay on and get blessed all the time on Morning Glow. You also... Go out of your way, your friends, international friends, local friends, challenge them to be part of this prayer, prophecy, and power every day from Monday to Friday. Uh, and then tonight when we have, it used to be our Bible study, but tonight is testimony night. And guess what? In the course of the testimony, we prophesy into people's life. In the course of the testimony, we prophesy into people's life. In the course of the testimony, and prophesying to people's life. So join us tonight. Don't miss it by any chance. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the holy name of Jesus. Glory to God. Glory to God. I close this morning by prophesying into your life. The God who stepped into formless void and dark situations and commanded light and spoke the universe into being. He shall speak into your darkness, Kayanebo, into your void, Kalebosha, into your formlessness, Nabariti, and bring forth a testimony in this season. Let your amen be powerful. The God who spoke into Israel's situation, Exodus 3, 7 and 8, and after years of slavery, brought them out of problem. He'll bring you out of every challenge in the name of Jesus. The God who reversed the Red Sea. He was the one who drew the boundary for the sea. And said, you shall not pass here. But then he drew a new boundary. For your sake, God will draw new boundaries, do new things. Joshua 3 verse 14 to 11. At the Jordan, God stepped in. The river again stepped out because God stepped in. Every river of Jordan, Jordan means death. <laughs> every river of Jordan, every killer will step out of the way for you in the name of Jesus. At Jericho, the wall tried to stop the people of God. God stopped the wall. God made the wall come tumbling down. Every wall preventing you will be removed because God will step in for you. At the shrine of Dagon, First Samuel chapter 5, verse 1 to 5. God stepped in and disgraced the power of darkness. God stepped in. He dismantled Dagon and brought him to pieces. Satanic altars sponsoring difficulties, afflictions, challenges against you. I prophesy they shall fail for your sake. And I close this morning by saying, he showed up on Mount Carmel. 1 Kings 18, verse 20 to 40. He humbled the, the prophets of Baal. He proved himself mighty in the life of his servant. He will step in for you again. He will humble every demonic entity that have come against you. He will give you victory in the name of Jesus. This is your portion. This is your story. This is your testimony in the name of Jesus. God bless you richly. Kodu Vubenis. Dios te bendiga. Dios te bensoy. Boana Akubariki.
Nyamishra, nyamishra why? Ibarikish, ibarike. Mwariva kukumbrere, iwamuzika ra yesu. Mkulu mkulu, agubu says, Good morning. Saubona. God bless you richly. We see you tonight. It's going to be great. It's going to be powerful. Make sure you continue to invite people to join us. You can always repeat morning glow. If I were you, the Bible says to continue to ask until your joy is full. Continue to play it. Instead of some rub me down music, play this. Let it bring your victory. God bless you richly. Amen.